Uh, in our neighborhoods, we don't always see our neighbors in need. We often see our neighbors putting their best foot forward. But I can tell you from experiences inside the clinic that a lot of your neighbors are hurting. What brought me to Christ Clinic was I was in Methodist Hospital in 2016 with congestive heart failure, and I actually died. This clinic is essential to the community and keeping its community members healthy and at work and supporting their families. So the poor have so many things against them already. They're already um, probably not getting the nutrition that they need. They don't have a healthy place to exercise. They're under a lot of stress just trying to make ends meet. And so it's not enough to just do standard of care for them. We have to meet their medical needs and at the same time try to holistically treat their, them to wellness. I was basically on the street living in a car with no hope. So uh, Christ Clinic gave me, first of all, that hope. Over the last couple years, we've really increased our access for patients to get health care here. We went from four exam rooms to 10 exam rooms. And since 2016, we've continued to grow, and we are preparing to open our 14th exam room. One of my goals as the medical director at Christ Clinic is to make sure that every member of our community has access to quality medical care. And to do that, it's very expensive. When you think about taking care of people that are uninsured and living in poverty, you can't just think about the standard of care. We have to do better than the standard of care. So it's very important that we receive financial support from the community to keep doing what we're doing here at Christ Clinic because healthcare is expensive. So the leading cause of bankruptcy in the U.S. is inability to pay medical bills. Patients get sick with something that would be routine, that they could, other people could just go to the doctor and their insurance would cover it, and then they show up in one of our local emergency rooms and they, they get billed for that. And those bills are collected upon and people are forced into bankruptcy. And this is happening in our community. We see patients are uninsured and um, they live in poverty and they can't afford to pay out of pocket for the medical care that they need. If the community wants to have wellness throughout the community, then the community needs to invest in the clinic and help us to meet the medical needs of these most vulnerable that live in our community. Yes, I wouldn't be sitting here if it wasn't for Christ Clinic because I couldn't afford health care. Like they say, you know, if you don't have money for health care, then you're just gone. Not at Christ Clinic. They help you, and donating money to them not only helps the clinic, but it saves lives. I'm living proof of that.